should be a simple one. This is legislation that codifies what Secretary Austin and General Milley said was their intent, and that's to not use taxpayer funds to throw drag shows on military bases. Can't even believe we have to have this discussion, but we do. And the reason we have to codify that understanding from General Milley and Secretary Austin in law is because when we asked them about these things that were happening on bases, they just stared right back flatly and said, they aren't happening. You know, drag, drag queen story hours is not something that uh, the department funds. Well, wait a second. Uh, that's actually not what the record seems to suggest. You were going to fund one at Ramstein Air Force Base. That one got canceled, but that's DOD insignia. That's a drag queen story hour for children. Then also at the Joint Base Langley Eustis, you put on a drag queen story hour on a Saturday for the first ever kid-friendly diversity, equity, inclusion summer festival. And at Nellis Air Force Base, you had the drag you Nellis on June 17th. Who funded these things, Mr. Secretary? Listen, uh, drag shows and, uh, are not something that the Department of Defense uh, supports or funds. So. But wait, why, why are they happening on military bases? I just, I just showed you the evidence. Why are they happening? Can I get copies of those? Because I'd like to take a look at those myself, actually. Take a look and, and find out what actually is going on there. Because I, that's the first I'm hearing about that kind of stuff. Uh, I don't read those news stories. I don't know what you're talking about. I'd like to take a look at those because I don't agree with those. Well, they're think, now in the official record. shouldn't be happening. Period. Thank you. Thank yeah. you for that admission.